It's your boy, Yoda Bang, Bro the Riches TV, back at it again. And today we got on the menu, man. We got 1090 Jake on the menu. 1090 Jake, let's talk about it, bro. Mr. Uh, Paperwork himself. Mr. You want to expose all the brothers out here in the rap game? You ain't exposed now. Other, you ain't exposed nobody else other than brothers. You hear me? You ain't exposed no G Easy when he went through his thing. You know what I'm saying? You ain't exposing uh 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 what's his name uh Eminem when he go his, through his thing. What about Machine Gun Kelly when he go through his thing? You ain't exposing none of these people, but you show sure is in our community. You show sure is in the rap game. Talking about out everybody finesse two times, <clears throat> spot him, got him, uh, 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 Boston Richie. You went at Kodak Black. You done went at all these rappers, bro, exposing paperwork on everybody, man. Now, now when paperwork come out on you, you want to downplay it. You didn't end up snitching on, 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 on some inmate in there. What's his name? What's his name? Oh, yeah, I think I got his name right now. Jimmy, Jimmy Horry. Jimmy Horry, you remember that name? You remember that name? Yeah, they said it was some type of ride that you was part of. Uh-huh, saying that the Bloods and the Zoes got into it or something like that, my brother. Uh-huh, type shit. And you got hit upside the head with a with a, with a rock in the sock. Bled your ass. Pow! Hit your ass right upside that goddamn noggin. Bobby Hill. Yeah, looking like Bobby Hill from motherfucking King of the Hill. That's all your ass look like. Every time I see you, that's all I see. You just here to destroy our culture, bro. You here, you you just here to fuck up everything. How do you even get this information, bro? But fuck all that. Fuck all that info. Fuck all that about. It. It's your turn. It's your turn. We got statements and shit that came out on your motherfucking head, bro. We need explanation behind this. And I seen you trying to clear it all up. Oh, I done made a, I done made a video about this now, nigga. <clears throat> we need you to switch up your channel, bro. We need to switch up your channel, bro, because you with that bullshit, bro. You know what I'm saying? How the hell are you going to call something, call yourself exposing people on, on, on paperwork, and you got paperwork out on your motherfucking self, nigga? You got paperwork out on your motherfucking self. Why you was in jail? Why you was in the land... Lancaster Correctional Facility. I don't know if that's in Florida some damn well. Yeah. You telling on inmates, telling on CEOs, telling on your partners, and you all over the internet. You trying to clear this shit up. We tired of you, man. We tired of you, Bobby Hill. Tired of you, my boy. Tired of you coming out here and, 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 and tearing up the rap game. Nick can't listen to music, man. You always got, oh, this rapper, this rapper came out, this rapper. Man, you need to switch this shit up, bro. Now nigga bust you upside your motherfucking head in the penitentiary, and you can go write a statement on him. Mm-hmm. Talking about your home, your big homie told you to lay it down, don't. What, nigga? Can't nobody tell me to not do a damn thing when I done got busted upside my damn head. You crazy? That don't even sound right. You talking about, oh, my big homie told me to lay down after I, my nigga. Did you damn near dry snitch on him? Was that part of the statement? Probably put that in the statement that your homie told your motherfucking ass. So he's in a part of your statement to dry snitch on one homeboy. You know what I mean? And then you telling me you done got hit upside the head with a damn rock and you listen to somebody tell you to lay it down, <clears throat> to chill the fuck out. Oh, don't do nothing. Just lay it down. The CEO's coming in. No CEO's whooping ass, but nigga, you could have kicked the nigga. Could have pinched the bitch. Nigga, you could have pinched the bitch. You know what I mean? And now you all over the internet. I see Seti Nas. You know, I know Seti Nas. That's your boy. He ain't going to come out and just, you know what I mean? But I see AK-47. He trying to pitch you in line and let you know what you should have said and all this shit. But, bro, we tired of your motherfucking ass in the coach, bro. You know what I mean? We tired of your motherfucking ass, bro. You need to get your ass on, man. Go find you another hobby. You not you might need to become a CEO. Become a private detective or somebody. You know what I mean? Cause it seemed like you 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 got you got some spider senses. You got some pretty good spider senses, my bro. For real. Just tired of this nigga this nigga Bobby Hill. All the time. He's snitching on inmates. Then he come out and expose 
all the rappers that we like. He he just exposed the rappers that we like. It, it can't be all the popping rappers that we get to liking y'all. All the songs, you know, all this shit here. He he come. Oh, they got paperwork out on them. My nigga, if you don't sit your motherfucking uh Michelin man built that ass nigga, built just like the Michelin man. Your ass needs to go get on a treadmill. Lay out them donuts, fat boy. Shit. Nigga got paperwork coming out on him. And and now he wanted to defend it, talking about, oh, he done been motherfucking picked this shit out. Nigga, we don't care about none of that shit, bro. You got to fix this motherfucking shit, Bobby Hill. We tired of your whole ass, man. We tired of your whole ass, man. We on you. We on that Adam 22, nigga. And we on motherfucking Vlad, nigga. Vlad ass. Really, I ain't, I ain't even... Now, y'all ain't seen me post no... No video on Vlad. I ain't even went off on Vlad yet, but you know what I'm saying? I've been on I've been on Adam 22 ass and now I'm coming on your ass, Bobby Hill. 1090 fake. You a fake ass nigga. You ain't no real ass nigga. You from Boston, then you move from Boston to Jacksonville or, or, or Florida, somewhere in Florida, you go to jail and shit. You come back, you think you're ten toes down, you think you hard. You ain't you ain't none of that. You know what I mean? Call yourself exposed to nothing but brothers, bro. You can't expose nobody in your community. My nigga, why you keep everybody in your community so secretive? Why you help push their agenda, my nigga? You'll say, oh, that ain't got nothing to do with you. Yeah, it does got something to do with you. You one of them, nigga. Can we let somebody else expose the rappers? We don't need you exposing the rappers. Let somebody else do it. Let AK-47 do it. Or let Seti Nash do it. You know what I'm saying? Let's let let's set in ass motherfucking uh, uh, expose the rappers. Man, we don't need you exposing the rappers. Go back to your jail stories and shit like that you was talking about. Them jailhouse stories that you was talking about in the penitentiary before all this shit happened. Before you became the paperwork man. No, your Pillsbury Doughboy ass gonna get up in here and say something. Every time an allegation comes out, it's like you, the motherfucker that comes out with a motherfucking, here goes a, here goes a motherfucking uh, a 40 minute video on how he's not the snitch or how he's is the snitch or how this guy snitched on him and they snitched on each other. All in your videos, bro. And you ain't gonna face none of these niggas. All these niggas that you talking about, you won't even face them. You don't want no smoke with them. But you not already created smoke with these niggas, man. Them niggas better not catch you out. I already know it. You you think you doing you think you doing a hell of a job. You really getting into some deep waters. See, what happens is you start exposing you start thinking you can just go and expose like street niggas and shit like that. You know what I mean? You all oh, you gonna expose but nigga it's it's shit get deep. Water get hot. You know what I'm saying? Nigga, it get deep, nigga. Once you get to playing with that fire, my nigga, you get burned. You get to speaking on niggas name, niggas die about the image, man. Niggas die by the image, my nigga. Niggas don't have two dollars, my nigga, in the hood, my nigga, but we die by respect, fam. You don't understand that. And you think your bitch ass can come because you have information to go to everybody records. You can go to anybody fucking records. You fucking goddamn informant. You can find anybody records, find out whatever anybody doing, and just spill the beans. But you're going through some real nigga shit. You're going through some real niggas. Paperwork and shit. And you find the niggas that been told, you saying they told when they juvenile and kids and shit like this, my nigga. You going too far, my nigga. You going too deep down the rabbit hole, 1090. Calm down. And now, pressure for to be applied to you. You hear me? Now people for to file up them comments, they gonna start dropping them rat emojis down in your motherfucking comments. Every time you post a goddamn... A uh, 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 video. Every time you upload a video, a short or something, or anything you do, nigga, they're gonna start dropping the rat emoji on your ass. And you already know, fucking uh, academics got it all on them. You know, once I, once DJ Academics posted, man, my nigga, everybody know. We all know then. The whole world know then. So once he starts saying it, nigga, we know. Now. DJ Academic, I don't know if he got anything against you, but he ain't. He, he seemed like he ain't no friends with you. Cause he exposed it. He don't give a damn. Now, like I say, AK 47, them niggas different. You know what I'm saying? Said he I got a little bond or some shit like that. You know what I mean? Y'all might, y'all cool. 
know what I'm saying? But DJ Academics don't give a damn about none of that shit. Once he get drunk on that goddamn Hennessy nigga, and he get to going live for about motherfucking four, five hours, nigga, ain't no telling what he might be talking about. And that chat, boy, that chat gonna have every trending topic, nigga, and he gonna be speaking on it. And that nigga go crazy when he in that motherfucking mode. Now, after he, after he didn't hit him by, after he didn't filled up that little red cup by two, three times, man. All right, now he on autopilot. Yeah, he on all of after he done filled up that cup two, three, red, uh, two, three times. Maybe four? Oh, that nigga gone. That nigga motor mouth. Ain't no telling what he might say. Ain't no telling what he won't say. You know what I mean? But yeah, once I seen that shit, I'm saying, okay, it's certified now. It's certified. This nigga here, he, we, we, it's, it's, it's exposed Bobby Hill. Let's expose 1090 Jake. Yeah, let's just all expose this bitch ass nigga, man. Let's get this nigga up out of here, man. Let's make it a trend to keep this nigga away from business, our business, the street business. We need to keep nigga like this away from our street business, man. You need to stay out the street, man. You need to start rapping or something, 1090J. This blog and shit, you, yeah, because this shit is no good for you, my boy. You done, you done build up a bankroll off this shit. Yeah, you done got some money, my nigga. Go ahead and burn off and just leave, my nigga. Go ahead and take the bankroll and run out to the sunset, my nigga. For real. Because you ain't, you ain't doing too much shit. But this is all I had to say about this nigga, man. Let me get off out this nigga ass. Man, y'all hit that like button, man. Y'all hit that like button. Hit them comments. Let me know if I'm wrong. Get on my ass if I'm wrong, man. Let me know if I'm tripping. You know what I mean? Subscribe. Subscribe. Hit that subscribe button. You know what I mean? It's your boy, Yoda Bang, Broke the Riches TV, and I'm gone.